Welcome back to Process Mining Explained. And you know it, it's me and my old buddy, Rudy. Rudy, you've told us what process mining is. You've told us who cares. You've told us what kind of data it draws together. But is process mining a one and done? Once I, I, I mine this process and I automate, uh, do I need to continue doing process mining or am I done? No, you are not done. You know, my example with the X-ray, maybe it's not the perfect one. Think about process mining as your, like, like a smartwatch. You know, you really want to know how well you are doing. So we use process mining, of course, first to discover RPA potential and to resolve the issues. But, you know, once you apply pros, uh, once you apply RPA, you want to measure the impact of RPA. You want to see how successful you are. You want to report to your manager how well the process is doing and the company is doing. So. You know, it's not only a one-time thing. For me, process mining and RPA is not a project. It's a journey. You start and you continue to becoming better every single day. So, you know, it's it's really, for me, it's, con it's a continuous um, work you do and you really will become better over time. Man, that's fantastic. Folks, if you're not doing process mining, reach out to you on Path today. We'll get an expert over there to show you how we can change your business. Uh, and continue to, to measure and grow, we're going to become more efficient. Uh, we're going to become uh, uh, more stable. Our error rates are going to go down. Uh, RPA at UiPath and process mining. We'll see you next time, Rudy.